own George Richardson say, We got a phone call out of the blue two weeks ago and they asked us to bring a reindeer and we were happy to apply. And next, Wills and Kate thank volunteers of Bat Lane Community Center Ridge near Edinburgh, where staff were mourning a parrot panic who died from COVID-19. William wearing a dark blue coat and tartan scarf and Kate in a blue Catherine Walker coat and carrying a bag by Scottish designer Strathberry thanks staff. Among them was parrot pandemic, Alistair Madsen, 54, whose dad died during lockdown. He said it was very emotional talking to Prince about losing my father. He was very anxious to hear how we managed to cope with the mental strains of our job. The next star for the couple who were known as the Earl and Drew West Jokes. The Duchess also met her phone, a friend, Len Gardner, 85. For the first time, she has been calling him since May as part of the Royal Voluntary Service Initiative to reach those feeling lonely. Full-time carer Len say that he gets on so well with Kate that he calls her love. She even sent him two kilos of flour and a pasta machine after they chatted about his love for making his own. And Len say of meeting her in the flash, I'm especially pleased about this day and it will live with me forever. The Countess of Strathairn in Scotland was Holy Trinity first go in Berwick upon Tweed, the northernmost town in England. The book chars, crackers, and baby echoes from a rent a raining deer in County Durham to keep the children entertained while they thank the teachers. Reindeer, Prince William and Kate Middleton win hearts on UK tour, it will live with me forever. Kate and William could not book Rudolph, Dancer and Brenster for their train tour of thanks yesterday, so they arranged for Charles, Crackers and Echoes to bring good cheer in state. The three lesser known reindeer, who were not among Santa's helpers to pay in a surprise visit to a school. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, both 38, are spending three days crushing the UK to thank frontline pandemic heroes. And yesterday they landed in Scotland and the north of England. They set off the night before London's Eastern Station, where by sinking Stephen's building out. Merry Christmas everyone on the platform of their invitation. The couple's first stop yesterday was the Scottish Ambulance Service in New 